at AUVSI's Exponential in Denver, Colorado, the term beeve loss is big this year. Well, it's big every year. It means beyond visual line of sight operations, and it's important for drones because it allows them to do their work without being tethered visually to the operator. It's been very difficult to figure this out, but a company called Precision Hawk says they have. So what we're showcasing here at AUVSI is some leading edge technology that truly is going to enable drones to fly beyond visual line of sight. One of the, the hindrances to date has been how do you make a drone not just aware of the environment around it, but also aware of all the other aircrafts that may be nearby, especially if you're out of range of uh, where the pilot can see. And there are two types of aircrafts you have to be aware of. Uh, the first is cooperative aircrafts, aircrafts that have an ADS-B transponder. We partnered with Harris to get a real-time data feed of all of the uh, aircrafts that have uh, ADS-B transponders that's fed directly into the drone, so that if one comes in the airspace, the drone can maneuver out of the way, alert the pilot uh, that there's an aircraft in the vicinity. Now that takes care of drones that are cooperative, but you also have a bunch of uncooperative aircraft. Uh, crop dusters, helicopters, electric hang gliders, uh, or other uh, small planes that may not have an ADS-B transponder. So it's always been important, what type of technology can you deploy on a drone to make it aware of those non-cooperative aircraft? Uh, when we looked out into the industry, we found out that radar wasn't going to be an option because uh, it was too heavy, it draws too much electricity, and uh, the radar uh, typically was only looking out in one direction and, and limited in its range of only a mile. But we came across some technology developed by a company called Sarah, who were experts in long-range acoustics. And what they had developed was they had developed a acoustic-based uh, aircraft detection system, uh, listening um, uh, to a tune of about 10 kilometers in a 360-degree sphere around the drone. It could identify all types of aircraft. Uh, and as soon as an aircraft enters that sphere, uh, the pilot is instantly alerted. And if it looks like the plane or the aircraft is getting too close, the pilot can maneuver the drone away. Or if then the aircraft continues on and gets dangerously close, the drone will automatically lower, moving itself out of the way. What we have here on the display four is a drone we are bringing to market. We partnered with the company Xfold uh, to build uh, this drone. It weighs under uh, 55 pounds. It has on it a hybrid um, engine, so it's uh, a gas and electric. It can stay in the air for about two hours. It can do over 40 miles. Uh, it has long-range communications and a parachute, but most importantly, it has the acoustic uh, based aircraft detection system. That's what you can see right above these propellers are small uh, but very powerful microphones and they're spread across on each of the propellers and we cancel out the noise of the drone that's flying and listen in the atmosphere for only the noise coming in from planes which can be detected as I said about 10 kilometers away. So we're very excited to showcase this technology here because I believe that if you really want to take that next step forward in the drone industry you need to be able to fly beyond a uh, visual line of sight of a mile and this technology is going to allow both uh, our, our clients and many of our partner companies uh, to do just that. And I think this is going to really elevate the entire drone industry and you're going to start to see a lot more BV loss waivers and a lot more long range work over the next year.